Welcome back to the NASCAR Thunder 2004 Career Mode Let's Play, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, I'm about to do race 2136. I'm going to Indianapolis Motor Speedway in Speedway, Indiana for the running of the Brickyard 400. And the uh, last race was at Pocono, and my car was fine, you know, it was decent and all. Still finished 27th, even though I qualified 14th. But I still felt like uh, the car was better than the first Pocono race. Felt like there was an improvement. I feel like this car is getting improvements. It just needs a little more. So I'm trying to work on that. I'm trying to wait and have the time for it to show up. But uh, yeah, I'm, you know, um, just, uh, man, just hope I can uh, have a good run in today's race. Let's see, garage, I want to show you. Uh, chassis number two, I'm repairing for one race. Uh, Engine number one, repairing for one race, and body number three, I'm building for two more races, and body number one, I'm repairing for two more races. Now, I won't have the freshest body for Watkins Glen, but I'll have like the freshest engine and chassis and all. I'm going into Indianapolis with some fresh stuff. Uh, no shop additions right now, I don't have the money for it, I'm trying to build up for that. That's what's so good about having extra bodies and chassis, uh, engines and all like that, is now that... I can work on more trying to get some more money. Uh, race week. Alright, no secondary sponsor. Let me uh, take care of that. Uh, let's see. Average start 25th, qualifying 25th, average start in 30th. Whew. I would feel more comf comfortable with NASCAR Thunder or Motorola. Uh, I don't think I'm going to qualify 25th in every race. Hmm. Might go with the safe bet and do NASCAR Thunder 2004. 18k for 18 races. All right, not bad. Uh, let me make sure. Um. Alrighty. All right. Let's just head on into the. Oh, gotta save. Alright, race weekend, there we go. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to do chassis number one, engine number two, and body number two. It's a car rate of 53, which I'm, wow, I'm disappointed with that. Let me, let me do so, oh my god, I was checking something real quick. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry this is taking forever, I know. I was going to do a quick select, see if I could get better car ring. Alright, better car ring of 54. What did I choose? Oh, okay. Whatever, we'll go with that. <laughs> Let's just go on to the race and see what happens here in Indianapolis. I uh, don't know what to expect here. <sighs> I don't know what to expect. Hmm. All right, Tony Stewart on the pole. Let's see what happens in qualifying. Oh God! Oh my! Well, oh, this lap's gonna be thrown away. It's okay. Usually the first lap it kind of is. Well, all right. Don't want to do the same thing in turn three. All right. Alright, here we come down to the line. And here we go. 43rd, 53, 62. I expected that. Ooh, okay. Alright, down the back straightaway for the final time. 
Went through turn one and two good that time. Let's see what I can do here. Oh, a little bit of a slide in turn three. Alright, here we go. Let's see. Definitely a better 51 not God, 34th. <laughs> I don't understand, but whatever. It is what it is. Let's just get on to the race and see what happens. The engines have fired and the cars are rolling off pit road here at Indianapolis Motor Speedway. T Dale Knight Jr. and Tony Stewart be on the front row of Tony Stewart, Dale Knight Jr. Let's get this race underway. I completed the first lap here at Indianapolis Motor Speedway. I'm just trying to hit my marks right now. I've only dropped back one spot at the line than where I qualified. Oh, good lord. That's not the kind of corner I wanted to have. Man. I'm just trying to, uh get around some of these guys. Three wide. Don't know how this is going to work out. Oh! Oh gosh, don't get up. Ah! Whew. A little bit tight. Okay, how did you get that run on me on the outside lane? Oh, 43 car, why? So, 
So far, not too bad. Oh, why would you block me, you fucking jack spray? Gosh darn it, stop sliding the car. Oh. All right. No! You better give me the room. All right. I'm moving up spots now. I'm trying. I'm really also taking my time to hit my marks. I ain't like trying to rush through it. Just trying to stay in some share draft as well. Here we go. All right. I mean, I do got straightaway pace. I'm happy with that. Oh, man. All right. I'm at my sponsor objective right now. Oh, gosh, Brett Bodine smacked the wall. All right. Some cars are hanging down pit road. I'm going to pit around lap seven. Wow. Round lap 7 of 16 going in lap 7 going into lap 8. Oh gosh. Yeah, but I feel like this car's got pace. Okay. I feel like this car is handling well too. Oh, Jerry Nadu pounds the outside wall. Craven. Oh. Ooh, I'm getting a little tight right now. I had to get on the brakes there. That's alright. I feel like this car's got something now. Look at that. Look at the pace I got. When I get into someone's draft, even without the share draft. Oh, but I did get a little tight there. But even without the share draft, this car's got something. Oh gosh, Shane Benson. You know what? I'll stay out another lap. Just in case. Yeah, I'll stay on their lap. So I'll just pit at the halfway point. I'll pit next time by. Oh, man. Oh my, I didn't mean to go on the outside, but look at this run I got. This is crazy. I mean, I'm happy. Don't get me wrong, but I'm really sa satisfied right now. Okay. I'm going to pit this time. Oh, gosh. I'm pitting this time by. Not bad pit road entry either. Alright, I'm fine with the setup and all like that. 17.2 sig piss up. Let's have a good stop, guys. Let's have a good stop. 
And no one's pitting this time by a ping, maybe a lure. Maybe I could have gone in their lab, but you know what? I want to be on the safe side and all. And here we go. Oh, I'm so firing you, whoever just pushed them out of the way. Oh my god. It was a second and a half slower! You fucking idiot! Oh my god, I'm so firing you. That's so bullcrap, man. Damn it. I'm not gonna come out in the last place, but I don't know how many positions I'm going to drop after that. Damn it. I mean, why? Why Why did that happen? Why is it that I actually have a good car that could maybe get a top 20 finish, actually, and then for them to do something like that? I mean, why? 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 Oh, my God. Well, I'm going to have to fresher tires than a lot of these guys now, so I'm definitely going to have some pace with that, but <clears throat> I'm upset with that. Golly. I think that was the tire, the rear tire changer that shoved him out of the way too. Oh, I didn't realize I was lapped down, honestly. Probably would have not been. See, these guys have not pitted yet. Look at how much pace I got with these guys. Look how much pace I have. I'm faster than the leaders right now. Oh, someone's blowing an engine too. And that is Ken Schrader. Oh, fuck me. Sorry, Ashton Lewis. I want to get around you, though. All right, here comes Tony Stewart and Dale Nard Jr. down pit road. Tony Stewart is the leader right now. Maybe I can still get my sponsor objective. Stay in the share draft. This car is still performing great. Just wish uh, my pit crew didn't. My uh, tire changer, rear tire changer, and uh, gas man did a better job. Not like shove each other for heaven's sakes. So I'm right behind Jerry Nadu right now. Ooh, Sterling Marlin's out of the race too. Well, I mean, I'm still gonna get my sponsor objective if I finish 30th or better, so. But I probably could have been in the top 25 or even in the top 20 had it not been that slow pit stop. That's do got five laps to go. Look at this big gap ahead of me between me and 26th. It's unbelievable. Ah, oh, man. I hope I don't finish 27th two races in a row, because that's honestly going to be kind of discouraging. I mean, I can understand what it was like at Pocono, don't get me wrong, but could have definitely been in a better spot right now had it not been for that pit stop. I mean, I feel, I feel like, for me, the car is improving. Hmm. I am gaining on the guys ahead of me, though, a bit, so... Maybe I will get up to them. Maybe I will possibly get a top 25 finish. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, I had to let off a bit there. Or else I would have smacked that wall. I don't know who I'm catching. I believe it's Jeff Green. Yeah, it is Jeff Green. I thought so. Oh, shit. 
Don't do that, car. Or don't do that, Joseph. Alright, so got three laps to go. I'm catching Jeff Green and Steve Park. If I can get by those both, I could get a top 25 finish, which is not bad. Look at the, just when I'm in the draft, look at the run I get. And get around Jeff Green, I'm clear of him. I'm definitely gonna, if I stay here, I'm definitely gonna do better than what I qualified. Uh, let's get into Steve Park's draft. Gonna have two laps to go right here. Just look at the straightaway speed I get. Oh, but don't do that too much. And that's Kenny Wallace, Ed. I feel like I can get up to Kenny Wallace. But I think that's all I'm gonna get. If I, if it looks like I can get by for 24th, but I think that's all I'm gonna get. I don't think I could get any more spots than that. Ah, oh, godly. Alright, final lap. Alright. Gotta run it. Oh, I don't want to go on the outside of him. Let me go to the bottom. You're gonna block me? Are you serious, Kenny? Damn you, Kenny. I'm just gonna let him go. I'm not gonna try to pass him on the outside lane. Oh, get out of my way. No reason for that. Alright, up to 24th, and I believe that's all I can get. Can't do any better than... Damn, whatever. What I can. I probably could have gotten a top 20 finish. I felt like I could have got a top 20 finish. If it wasn't for my pit crew. I'm so firing them after this. Well, sh I should just fire my, uh... Rear tire changer. I don't think it was really the gasman's fault. He got shoved out of the way by the rear tire changer. I might just fire the rear tire changer for that. Whatever. I'm gonna finish 24th. It's not bad. I'll take it. It's, I did get my sponsor objective for that, but I could have probably gotten better than that. Dale Jarrett wins here at Indianapolis. Ah. Uh. Whatever. This is what it is. Let's. I do. Wow. I do get a good amount of money. Two hundred sixty-six thousand right now. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take that money. Oh man. It's pretty good. That is pretty good. All right. I'm. I'm happy. With that, I could have probably finished better, though. So let's go to my team management real quick. See what's going on here. I'm going to have fresh new stuff. Wow, I'm really going to have fresh new stuff for, uh... For, uh, Watkins Glen. Uh, except for the... For, yeah, except for the body, but I think anything else I'm going to be fine with. I don't think... Uh... Maybe I'm going to repair this engine at least. Wait. I have enough money to overhaul, right? Ooh. Hmm. Let me see. See, it's not even that big of an improvement. 61 to 62 to 59-61. It's not really that big of an improvement. I think I'll just stick to the repairing right now. Until I really get on money. I don't... I, see, I'm... Uh, yeah, alright. I think I'm okay with this. See, I could get the chassis shop, but I don't have enough money now. Alright, I... I think I'm okay with this. Alright, so next race is going to be a Watkins Glen second road course race. I will just see you there.